Katrina. It turns out this is even easier than I thought it was because you've already got something in place to do this. Uh, I don't on my own, so this is good to see here. When you look at your menu, you will see something here called WP Vivid Backup. Super useful. Backup and restore options. Database and Word files. This is like everything, including your database. Saving it locally, I guess. Uh, I guess you can do remote storage. I don't know what locally means. If it's going to save it to my computer, I hope not. Uh, backing up now. Uh, it's starting the backup process and it looks like it is going through it. So even easier than I thought. Uh, once this is done, I'll make sure I know where it's sitting and then I will, uh, once this backup is run, I will update the WordPress, which FYI isn't a big deal. Uh, I've never, knock on wood, had a problem with this. When I've updated WordPress, it's always a background thing. I've never had interference with my website. So that's how this is done. There you have it. Hopefully that's all there is to it. Thank you.